There are only eight months left before the voters' registration for the 2022 national elections closes. But since registration resumed on January 4, only 1 million out of the expected 5 million new voters have registered. Commission on Election spokesperson James Jimenez attributes the low turnout to the limited operating hours of Comelec offices due to the pandemic. Comelec offices are only open Monday to Thursday from 8 a.m. to 3 p.m. But the Comelec officials said they are looking into opening satellite offices by the end of the month. With close to 4 million uh, registrations still expected to be, to be processed, it's becoming very crucial becoming very critical that we basically get a move on. No? So hopefully, by the end of this month, nga, makapag, uh, roll out na tayo ng mga satellite registration. The National Movement for Free Elections, or NAMFRIL, also acknowledges that the pandemic hampers the registration of Filipinos overseas and those who had gone home to their provinces. But the legal network for truthful elections say the pandemic should not hamper the conduct of polls. Kita naman po natin in other countries, mga kapitbahay natin, Sri Lanka, Myanmar, Singapore, nakakapag-election naman eh. For election watchdog Contra Daya, the real threat for the conduct of the 2022 elections is the proposed charter change. The current proposal uh, to change the charter uh, may result in the postponement or even a can the cancellation of the 2022 elections. Uh, if some legislators would have their way in lifting their term limits. Carito said electoral competitiveness is also one of the problems during the polls, especially in the local race where only few candidates run in a polls. And in some cases, a candidate has no contender at all. Because of this, Carito said some Filipinos are left with no choice but to vote for a candidate they barely know. Comelec and Namfrel are also keen on using social media platforms for voters' education. I've seen some voters' education using TikTok. I've seen, uh, of course, you see YouTube no? being the most uh, uh, popular uh, choice for voters' education. And we were convincing um, people in the legislature to institutionalize it, no? uh, I think, a couple of uh, years ago. Voters' registration will be open until September 30, 2021. For News 5, Jen Kalimon, we are One News.